Hello everybody, today I'm going to show you how you can use a free web tool called Screencast-O-Matic in order to give feedback to your students' writing. And this tool is free. Uh, I'm going to show you how you can give feedback to someone's written work now. As you can see, a student has produced a piece of work with some mistakes and we'd like to give them feedback. So the first thing you have to do is to go to Screencast-O-Matic this is the web page for Screencast-O-Matic. It's totally free to use. Click on Start Recording for Free. Open Recorder Launcher. And then in the corner of your screen, this will come up over here. As you can see, I'm speaking and the green lines are moving up, which means that it's recording successfully. Next you can click record. You're allowed 15 minutes of recording for free. It will do a countdown and then you can start giving feedback. So let's open the student's work and start making corrections. Okay, put and ploy. Well done. You've done a very beautiful piece of writing. I like that you've explained how to make cookies and you've used some of the language which we studied correctly. And I'm going to take that out and change it. This is blue, it's underlined blue, which means your spacing might need to be changed. If it's blue here, we'll just put the spaces. Let's correct these first. Okay, anything with blue lines, let's fix the spacing. That's plural. I checked, I think, when you check for ingredients, I think you checked in the cupboard. Of course. Please go find it in the refrigerator. The fridge. Now, well done. Very good. You've done an excellent job. And I'd like you to keep up the good work. Just look over these mistakes and try and remember. Make a note of the things we've changed. Well done. So we've clicked stop now. And we've clicked done. As you can see, it's taken five, we've got five minute recording. You can save it as a file. You can edit the video if you have a paid account. This is the free account. So I'm going to upload it now. And you'll come up with several options. I like to save it to YouTube and then share the link with students. And it's now uploading and you can click publish and your recording will be saved to YouTube. Let's play back what we've recorded. So let's open the student's work and start making corrections. Okay, put and ploy, well done. You've done a very beautiful piece. So as you can see, it has saved. So you can share that with your students and if they hear your feedback, I think that's very good that it adds the human element to your class and helps to build rapport.